Let's take a look at replacing the PCV valve on this Dodge Durango 4.7 liter engine. Now this is different than most PCV valves. Typically you can rattle them and you'll hear a spring and a check ball in there move around. This particular one, it's really nothing more than a pre-calibrated orifice tube to control a slight amount of vacuum to the crank case to allow it to breathe. And over time that can plug up causing excessive crankcase pressure which will ultimately result in uh, smoking or oil consumption of the vehicle. So in order to remove it, you can see I've got the air cleaner assembly out of the way here. I'm simply going to take a flat screwdriver or a little bit of a hose hook tool and work it out of the vacuum line on the back of the engine here. We're over on the passenger side rear of the engine and we can pop that up out of there. And we'll have to do a little bit of rotating and twisting here to get it out of this hard plastic line. We have to be careful if this line is kind of brittle, we don't want to crack it and snap it off. But with a little bit of work and a little bit of prying here gently, we will get this out. Well, after some pulling, digging, and prying, I finally got the old one out of here. And if we look inside of here, you'll see there's some uh, buildup in there and the orifice is actually plugged up. So this thing was well overdue to be replaced. Now we're going to take our new one. You'll notice that there's an arrow pointing here, which is going to indicate towards the engine. And so we need to put that in right here. Pops in a little bit easier than the old one came out. And we'll gently slide it back down below. Pop it in there. Make the rest of our connections here. Get our other lines out of the way. And we're all set. We've just replaced the PCV valve on this 4.7 liter engine.